me and my buddies were sitting in the battlegrounds talking about, man, we're going to be looked as hero. We're in, we, we are in, in the history books. So we're going to be taken care of when we get home. You want to see my home? You want to see my, my home? My home is right there. You know what I'm saying? That's my home. That, that red Jeep. We've started to run into homeless vets in New York City, and there could be as many as 100 of them right now, like out on the streets. The war is about that you have soldiers out there standing on the front line, waiting to protect you. You know what I'm saying? Waiting to protect Donald Trump. Waiting to protect everybody. And you're telling me the people we're protecting cannot fund anything? We were joining the military to get out this shit. You know what I'm saying? It's like, all right, I've been in the shelter. It's going on a year, be a year next month. That's crazy. I'm not cold-hearted. I'm not like America. I'm gonna come back for you. I'm a soldier. Of course, I'm gonna come back for you. I'll be right back. You wanna go to a place where you're gonna hold a weapon and get shot at? You can't deal with the subway right now. My family is homeless now. The other vets is homeless now. You know what I'm saying? We're not homeless five years from now. Yes, every day I look at people that deny me for shit. Yes, I do want to put a bullet in their head. Yes. May God bless you. And may he watch over the United States of America. But I fought for my country, man. My country shouldn't be doing this anymore. <laughs>